Hi everyone. Uh, it's been a long time since I've uploaded a video so I thought I'd uh, try and get back into it and um, so here's something I've made recently. Um, it's just a steampunk wicker heart. Um, it, whoops, it was just plain like this. It's just a dimensional wicker, very lightweight heart and um, I've been wanting to do something steampunkish for a while but uh, couldn't find the right project that inspired me um, but then I decided I'd have a go at this tonight so um, what I did to start with was I made some uh, cardstock or I got a sheet of white cardstock and coloured it with distress inks and um, ran it through the embossing folder, I think it's called Tim Holtz Riveted Metal um, and it comes with another one I think is called Diamond Plate and then I just cut out these pieces of card to fit where I wanted them there's another one underneath there, another one up there so they're just pieces of card and I just used hot glue to stick them on and uh, then I got these gears underneath, these little wooden gears, which were um, one of the Prima Sunrise Sunset little packets of gears. I'll just grab one and show you. They're from the Finnabar range. Just those ones there. Um, and then I just sprayed those up with some Lindy stamp thing and coloured them with some... Um, Distress ink as well. Uh, some of them I cut in half to fit in to the little gaps where I wanted them. Um, this one here. And just again, I used hot glue to glue those in. Um, this is a fabric flower, and this fabric is really, I don't think the camera will pick up the photo, pick up the colour, but it's almost glowing. It's very iridescent, and um, it has this really sort of glowing shiny look about it um, so and I actually made that flower a long time ago and it decided to pop it on this one uh, this is just a little metal piece with a brad that I stuck in the middle this was off a piece of jewelry um, and that one also was another piece of jewelry with another little layered flower on the top metal flower uh, this Inspire was just die cut out with white cardstock and then I've just uh, gone over it with some Versamark and then embossing powder to give it that sort of shiny wet look. Um, my little butterfly here, I'm not sure if it will pick up, um, it's just a metal charm and the glossy accent isn't quite dry yet so it might look a little cloudy on the film but it's just, I've layered this side of the wing with little miniature clock parts there we go, I think that's focusing now uh, just to give it a bit more of a steampunk feel um, just crisscross some chain, I had some sort of white chain um, so just crisscross that over and then I coloured some um, muslin cloth with again Lindy stamp gang and distress inks and also just uh, tarnished up the or aged up the piece of lace here with the distress inks and um, to make it look a little bit old so yeah that was my little wicker steampunk heart um, this is actually going to go out in a rack shortly to um, somebody in my craft group that I um, I'm in the Nothing But Crafts group on uh, Facebook. Um, so yes, someone will get this in a rack shortly. And I uh, hope whoever gets it really likes it. Thanks for watching. See you soon.